Unfortunately, humans can be very violent creatures. While a perfect world would be without war and violence and have no need for weapons, that's sadly not the world we live in. From hefty sticks to sharp blades to deadly guns, we've created plenty of weapons that have evolved alongside humanity. Those are all pretty standard things we've all heard of, though. What about the crazier stuff? What about the 10 most insane weapons of all time? That's exactly what we'll be taking a look at today. Before we get started, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And thank you for watching. Number 10. Vomit Gun Coming in at number 10 on the list is the Vomit Gun. Similar to a flashlight, the LED incapacitator is a non-lethal weapon used to cause a reaction of vomiting, disorientation, cranial pressure, and other similar symptoms to the target. It is commonly used by the Border Patrol and police. In August 2007, the United States Department of Homeland Security demanded a prototype via a contract worth $800,000 presented to the IOS, Intelligent Optical Systems. Number 9. Digital Revolver Coming in at number 9 on the list is the Digital Revolver. Armatix, a German manufacturer, produced a high-tech piece of firearm. This gun is only able to be fired when in range of an electronic wristwatch worn by the user, preventing enemies from stealing it and using it themselves. The .40 caliber Glock 22 is described to have an easy recoil. Number 8. Flame Tank Coming in at number 8 is the Flame Tank. Back in Vietnam in 1968, the Marines used a death trap known as the M67 Flamethrower Tank. Some of these tanks even had machine guns attached to them. Common users of them were the United Kingdom, Italy, the Soviet Union, Japan, Germany, and the United States. Despite the horror it brings to the faces of its enemies, the M67 flamethrower tank was actually the last one ever used in American military service. Number 7. SARS Bomba Coming in at number 7 on today's list is the SAR Bomba. SAR Bomba was a Soviet Union-produced RDS-20 hydrogen bomb. It was activated on October 30, 1961. The bomb was equal to 58 megatons of TNT. In fact, this bomb is even referred to as the most powerful nuclear bomb ever created. If you do some digging around in Google Earth, you can actually go and look at the crater this thing left when it exploded in October of 1961. Number 6. V-2 Ballistic Missile Coming in at number 6 is the V-2 Ballistic Missile. The German-made V-2 guided ballistic missile was the world's first long-range member of its type and was designed by Werner von Braun. Its top speed was 3,580 miles per hour with a mass of nearly 28,000 pounds. They were made from 1942 to 1945. Despite these specific models no longer existing, they live on today in newer models. When Germany collapsed in World War II, the Allied forces got them to surrender many of their personnel and much of their technology. In fact, many of the original team that worked on the V-2 ended up working for the Redstone Arsenal. Number 5. PHASR Coming in at number 5 is the PHASR. PHASR stands for Personal Halting and Stimulation Response Rifle. Though still a prototype due to the 1995 UN Protocol on Blinding Laser Weapons, the premise of the weapon is to cause a temporary blindness on its target. The prototype weapon has been developed by the Air Force Research Laboratory's Directed Energy Directorate of the U.S. Department of Defense. Number 4. Pulsed Energy Projectile Coming in at number 4 is the Pulsed Energy Projectile. Another non-lethal weapon, the Pulsed Energy Projectile causes plasma to explode under the skin of the target. The weapon uses a form of electromagnetic radiation via the chemical deuterium fluoride to cause a deep level of pain and even paralysis. Thankfully, however, the manufacturer of this device was cancelled due to public concern. This device would have been far too easy to abuse, using it for things like torture with lack of physical evidence. Number 3. Bat Bombs Coming in at number 3 are Bat Bombs. Though only ever used in experiments during World War II, the United States attached small incendiary explosives to the backs of Mexican free-tailed bats. The idea was designed by Louis Frazier in January of 1942. Thankfully, this never became a frequently used idea, thanks to the finite number of bats and obvious cruelty that comes along with it. Unfortunately, though, this isn't the only example of humans trying to weaponize other species for their own gain. Number 2. Attack Dolphins Coming in at number 2 is the hilarious yet cruel concept of attack dolphins. The program providing us with dolphins trained to do things such as detect mines 
retrieve lost military equipment, and defend ships in the U.S. Navy Marine Animal Program, NMMP. The program has been alive since the early 1900s. In 2005, during Hurricane Katrina, dolphins with poison darts reportedly escaped from Lake Pontchartrain containment space. Number 1. Golf Ball Grenade Finishing off our list in the number one spot is the Golf Ball Grenade. The V-40 Mini Grenade was made from the 1960s to roughly 2008 by the Netherlands. The device was actually used by the U.S. Armed Forces and the Canadian Forces. Almost exactly the size of a golf ball, it steel 2.6 inches. The grenade had a 950 range of impact. The small size of this device made it easy to carry multiples, but that could also be very dangerous, as locating the primer with gloves on could be a common struggle, and you definitely don't want your pocket blowing up in the middle of battle. This concludes today's video on the 10 most insane weapons of all time. Are there any other wacky yet deadly devices out there that you believe we missed? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.